All right, welcome back. A summertime staple returns to the D. I'm talking about GM River Days presented by Soaring Eagle Casino and Resort. And here to tell us what we can expect this year is the director of programs for the Detroit Riverfront Conservancy, uh, Michelle Marine. Good morning and thank you for joining Good us. Good morning. Thank you for having us. So when is uh, GM River Days? June 24th, 25th and 26th. So this weekend. So that's coming up. That's here. It sure is. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So I know a lot of people have attended, but if someone were new to the area and they didn't get a chance to check it out, what, what can you expect? Absolutely. What's it like? So we've got more than 50 musical acts. We've got a wow. wonderful rides and game fairway, 20 great, great rides for the kids. We have an all free kids zone, so plenty of activities for the little ones. A lot of water activities. We have jet ski, ski demonstrations, a search and rescue demo, Coast Guard cutter that they can tour, a tall ship Appledore 4 that they can tour. Um, lots of live nature activities presented by the DNR. So great things, family fun for everyone. What about the uh, musical acts? Talk about some of uh, some of the acts that we can see. Absolutely, we're excited. More than 50 musical acts. So we've got the B-52s on Friday okay. night. We've got Miss Patty LaBelle on Saturday night, nice. and Mint Condition on Sunday. So it's going to be a great lineup. Something for everyone. Now, admittance, you mentioned the free kids zone. How much does it cost to get in? Exactly. We try to keep it very reasonable. So it's $3 before 3, $5 after 3, and it's free on Friday until 5 p.m. Okay, now this is uh, obviously just a huge event, a, a spectacle to be sure. Uh, what are some of the events that are taking place that you, you can't find anywhere else? Yeah, absolutely. We've got a great zip line, so folks enjoyed that. that last year, which is really a lot of fun. We've got a climbing wall, as I mentioned, the tall ship. So many things that you can't do anywhere else other than River Days. And in downtown Detroit, no less. Exactly, right on the beautiful riverfront. What else uh, can people expect? I imagine there's food that's available. I mean, everything Absolutely. you're looking for. Yep, we have sort of a taste of Detroit food court. So we've got plenty of great offerings from all different restaurants around the area. Um, looking so. at some of it now. Oh, we were. We got the jet skis out now. Fantastic. So what should we know before we head down there? Because there are obviously going to be a lot of people down there. Any plans to, that we should take into account before heading down? Or? Yeah, just be comfortable, comfortable walking shoes and bring the whole family. Very, very fun for the entire family. Where exactly is this located? I know it's along the riverfront. Is this like right. behind Hart Plaza or where? Uh, near the, the Renaissance Center. Okay. Uh, Rivard Plaza is kind of the hub of activities, but it's a mile long footprint. So, so. it's extending quite a way. Exactly. Uh, up, up the uh, the uh, river. Exactly. How many years has this been around? This is our 10th annual, so it's really special for that. Anything extra you guys are doing this year to celebrate that? Exactly. We'll be doing sort of a little birthday theme, so a little parade, nice. uh, opportunity for the little ones to enjoy some cupcakes with us. So, yeah, we'll be celebrating a little birthday party atmosphere. And I imagine people from all around, you got Toledo just, just right down the street, so obviously a huge draw for this general area and, and beyond. Fantastic. And our friends from across the water in Windsor, oh, yeah. of course. Oh, yeah. All right, well, Kanan and Alicia, are you guys planning to uh, to check it out this weekend? I mean, you can't help but 